everyone, welcome back to episode 3 of Vlogmas. I really hope you've enjoyed the last two episodes. This week's episode is going to be just a little bit of a more, more of a montage of um, clips I think, just because I've got a few things that I need to do but I'll probably just make a nice little montage video. I'm having one of those weeks where I just want to have a bath, have a nice pamper, do a face mask, wash my hair, my eyebrows need doing, <laughs> the nails need sorting. Um, so I just thought that I would film a nice little montage video. I hope you don't mind. I might just sit down and have a little chat with you at some point this week. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and, and yeah, I hope you enjoy. <laughs> Wednesday the 20th. I've just filmed a video on this hair and makeup festive look. So I've just got some tidying to do today. I've got some more wrapping to do. These nails though, desperately need doing. So when I've cleaned up, I'm going to wrap the presents because that's all I've got to do. And I'm going to do my nails because look at them. This one doesn't even have a gel on anymore. This one, well actually I've been waiting for them to grow out of it because this one has a split but down my nail. Tomorrow is the baking day. I am making gingerbread and white chocolate cookies, milk chocolate cookies, flapjack, butternut squash soup and a bonoffee pie. Why I decided to do that? <laughs>
bit of a ending to this vlog and I also wanted to um, just show you what I got for Christmas um, I just want to say that I'm not bragging about what I got for Christmas this year has been financially difficult for me and I'm sure a lot of people so I mean, it's very tight this year but I'm very grateful for what I got and yeah I just thought I'd show you what I got so I did get some money um, I'll probably just save that and put that in my savings account um, so I'm very grateful for that for my grandparents I got this gorgeous um, soap and glory set uh, how cute is this bag it's like a little clutch bag so inside I got a body butter the scent is Blackberry and musk, and it smells incredible. I had a bath, I had a shower last night, and um, slathered myself in this afterwards, and it smelled amazing. And then it came with a body scrub, and then it also came with a body wash, which I used in the shower last night, and so nice. Even my boyfriend complimented me that I smell nice. <laughs> So that's a win. And then it also, come, also comes with a face mask, which I'm really loving these sheet masks at the moment. I think I shoot in a vlog. Um, I, I had a Garnier one and I used it last night. And oh, my skin feels the best it's ever felt. So I do definitely recommend those. Oh, I don't have it here with me, but for my mother-in-law I got, um, not that one, I got a new dressing gown. It's pink and fluffy and it's so cosy. Um, she got me some of these gorgeous, like, fluffy socks. And I'm in need of some new fluffy socks, so she must have read my mind. So I got the green colour and, like, a beige colour. And then she also got me these gorgeous, like, slipper grippy socks. So I love those. She also got me a massive bar of dairy milk because I love dairy milk. She also got me this cute little lantern because I love things like this um, and some tea lights to go with it. And she also got me these little fragrance oils that you put, I think you put them in like a, one of those burner things. I've never used an oil before, I've only ever used the wax melt so 
I'm gonna give it a go and see how it goes, but they smell amazing. And then for my mum, I got this gorgeous M&S Swiss Truffle Assortment tree, but it actually lights up. I don't know if you'll be able to see because there's truffles in it. Oh, you can see a little bit there. All the chocolates are still in there, so. I love that. And then lastly from Jim, we just didn't really do very much for Christmas this year, um, but he did get me a perfume. Um, this is the Femme perfume from Hugo Boss and it smells incredible. I also got him an aftershave. It's really hard when you buy things online because you don't know what they're going to smell like. This smells so good. Look how cute this bottle is. If anyone ever had the Britney Spears Curious perfume, I'm going to sneeze because it's gone up my nose. Yeah, very much like the Britney Spears Curious perfume which I used to have and I love. This is very much like that. So yeah, I love that. It's a bit weird because I've washed it, but he got me this Ford Bronco t like vintage t-shirt. And it's got a Ford Bronco on it, which is a dream of mine to have. Um, but this is from Hollister. Um, and yeah, can't wait to wear that. And then the last thing he got me was some Lush Bath Bombs, which I haven't had Lush Bath Bombs for years, I want to say. I buy them for gifts for people, but I've never actually, I, I don't really buy them for myself. But he got me some bath bombs, and I'll show you what ones he got. So I don't actually know the names because I don't have the piece of paper that says what they're all called. But I'm sure if you are Lush fans that you'll know what they're called. Firstly, he got me, I think this is called Intergalactic. It's quite like a pepperminty um, smell. It smells amazing, can't wait to use that. And then the next one he got me, I can't remember what this is called. It smells quite floral, I like that. Um, yeah, so he got me this one here. And then the next one, I, I think it might be called like Christmas pudding or something. Because it looks like a Christmas pudding. Mmm, <laughs> that smells so good. These have been in my living room and every morning I go in there and my house just smells like the last shop. <laughs> and then he got me, I think this, this must be called gingerbread something. Oops bit of a messy one. This little gingerbread man here, how cute is he? It smells so good, it's got glitter on it. So cute. And then the last one he got me is the Snow Fairy, which I love. Oh, I can't wait to use that. Oh, why does this smell so good? So lots of cosy self-care, skincare which is right up my street. So I'm very, very happy and grateful for what I got for Christmas. So that is it for Vlogmas 2023. I'm hopefully gonna edit this today and possibly get up tomorrow. It's, today's the day after Boxing Day. Um, we had a lovely Christmas. I got a few snippets in there, but we really just sat on the sofa for the last two days and ate and watched movies and had a lovely time together. So I really hope you had a lovely Christmas and happy new year i'm really excited to carry on making videos in the new year i've really enjoyed doing vlogmas this year just because it's december's kind of a bit of a difficult time for me so it's nice to have had something to keep my mind busy and something to focus on so if you have watched any of my vlogmas i really really appreciate it and i really hope you've enjoyed and yeah i hope you have a lovely new year and i will see you very soon <music>